What's going on guys, Mr. Jason back here again with another episode of my mail packages that unbox and divide print Blu-rays, DVDs, sometimes video games. In this case, there's no video games in this episode, but we got a stack here right here. So if you're curious to see what are in these bad boys right here, just stay tuned. You see, Jason was my son. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna get into this opening right here. Start off with this package. Let's see. Should have a couple things in this one. Ooh, Ooh that hurt. My shelf on my PlayStation 5 is sitting on. My elbow just went oof. close to the funny bone, but not quite. So it hurt quite more than expected. Um, and here we go. This one here is gonna give another shout out to a fluffy gamer. Another YouTuber who goes on a hunt looking for out of prints and stuff and puts up videos where he actually goes to uh, the stores that he goes to and films some footage when he's in the store and what he finds and talks about what he gets and, sh and stuff like that. I almost said some vulgar language, but here we have The Simpsons Season 18 on DVD. Oh! 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 You butcher! Don't worry, sweetie. I'm sure that man has some special tooth problem. I don't even have a special tooth problem! Um, Ken Fluffy Gamer, when he comments or mentions to anything of me that he finds or in his videos, certain items that he finds, he tells me to be on a lookout for them, and when he does, not too long after, I for some reason seem to find it. So, again, Fluffy Gamer, thank you. I appreciate it. Shout out to you. Link to his channel will be in the description down below. But this here, I, I think it can go for about like 50 to $70 or so. I paid, I don't remember exactly, but of course I always put the prices up on the screen here. I want to say about like $24 or $25 for this. It's got that slip the outer box as well, so that's always a good thing. And then we have the Simpsons 16th, wait, this is the 18th. I don't know if I said six, 17 or 18, but this is the 18th season. I might have said 17th, I don't remember. But here we have the 16th season on DVD. This I paid, I think, about like $15 or so for, and it can go for about like 30 to 40 usually. So decent profit between those. All right, and here we are, moving on to the next package. I'm gonna find out what it is. Looks like it has a slip cover, or whatever this is. I forgot I even got this. I don't know why I forgot. I thought I got the DVD and not the Blu-ray for whatever reason, but here we have the Simpsons 17th season on Blu-ray. Um, I honestly don't remember an esti estimated price of what I paid for it or what it goes for. But from what I do remember looking it up with the slipcover, of course, it it's profitable. But I, I'll leave the price and the value of what it goes for on the screen here. Moving on to the next package. Well, we're already like halfway through with this. We're moving right along, guys. Um, let's see. Got this box right here. Open it up. Oh, I'll, here we go. This one is decent profit. I don't know. The price went up a little bit on these for me, anyways. Like, I used to pay $10 for this. We have Dogma on Blu ray. Some fuck named John Hughes. 16 Candles, John Hughes? You know that guy, too? That fucking guy. Made this flick 16 Candles. Not bad. There's tits in it, but no bush. I used to pay $10 for these, but they jacked the price up to, I think it was like $28 or so, but it's still profitable. It can sell for like 55 to 60. So it's almost double of my money. Can't complain there. I wish it stayed at $10 though, but whatever. I'm going to be moving on to the next package here. I've been finding these a lot lately. Here we have, Are You Afraid of the Dark? Season one on DVD. <laughs> usually find season two more. Man, it smells like candy. Whatever that crud is on the case. It's got, it's like makeup or something. It smells like candy or some kind of fruity makeup of some sort. But anyways, I paid eight for this. Each season can usually go for like, I want to say at least 15 to 20, sometimes more. So I paid eight either way, it's profit. 
Man, all I can smell is makeup, a fruity, some kind of fruity smell. But here's the last package right here. Yeah, there's two items in here. And here we have Halloween 4 on Blu-ray. Michael. Why now? I paid... I think four dollars. I think these were eight each and I used my points, I think. I can't remember, so I should have paid either eight dollars for this. And if I did use my points, I got half off and paid four maybe. I don't know. Like I said, I always have the price of each item and the value of what it goes for on the screen. But either way, these go for at least 20 bucks or so. So it's profit there. And then we have Halloween 5 on Blu-ray. Same thing. I might have used my points. Might have been half off. It was either eight or four. I don't know, but I sent, this goes about 15 to 20, so it's still decent profit. Man, all I can smell is that fruity makeup smell. God damn. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. And then off this episode right here. This is my stack. Halloween 5, Halloween 4, Blu-ray. Are You Afraid of Dark Season 1, Dogma Blu-ray. Simpsons Season 17 Blu-ray. Then Season 16 Simpsons DVD. And seasons, uh, Simpsons Season 18 on DVD right there slightly out of focus but yeah so that's gonna do it for this episode if, let me know in the comments down below if you have any of these in your collection if any of these are new to you just finding out that they're worth what they're worth or just finding out that they're actually out of print and you had no idea just let me know in the comments down below what you thought about these pickups and if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed please do so and if you already are michael appreciates it see him right there he appreciates it and if you're not subscribed he's gonna come find you and get you but yeah just help me out. The algorithm, if you give these videos likes, if more clicks of these videos, it helps push it out there in the algorithm. But other than that, I'm just floating around somewhere in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Pun intended because Spider-Man No Way Home just came out. I did go see it. I do have a out and, out and about slash no spoiler review for it already out. So go check that out. I'll probably put it in video link at the end of this video. But guys, I will catch you in the next one. Take care.